Hi, brothers and sisters. This is Sabrina. <clears throat> my name means patience in the Word of God. And uh, it's not my patience, it's His, as I've tell, told people. I have a great, exciting uh, message for everyone today. Now, we know that the Word is powerful. We know that uh, the power is in that's in the Word comes by the Holy Spirit. Otherwise, it's a dead letter, and the letter kills. But the Word of God gives life whenever it's empower, empowered by the Holy Spirit. So, um, you know, this, this message about the Word of God has been on my heart for a long, long time. And he's been pressing me to, to get this done. So, you know... I'm just going to give you a part of it right now, and it's going to be an ongoing thing. Because the Word of God is flowing, it's living, it's, uh, his, his Word is, uh, flows from His throne, from His belly flows living waters, and then from us, He pours that cup, in, he, our cup overflows, and living waters come up from our belly and out. Because your heart's really in your belly. That's where the heart's connected to, this, to the um, Holy Spirit. And you have to be coming from the Holy Spirit, not from your flesh, whenever you give these messages. Um, and so I always invite the Holy Spirit, Father God, Eternal Father, um, Jesus Christ, um, God the Son, the Son of God, um, to be in these videos because I don't want to do anything that's about me. Um, the thing about us on YouTube, a lot of us, not all of us, but a lot of us, um, we are not, we're not bought, we're not driven by man-made doctrines, we're not driven by man-made traditions, we're not driven by, um, a, you know, man-pleasing, we're not man-pleasers, um, we're God-pleasers, we care what our Father, we care that our Father's pleased. We are walking in, in one accord, I believe. We're getting the same messages, but some of us different times, or some of us different messages, but they all connect together, and it's really quite beautiful how God's perfect Word is always a part of it. You can always find our videos in His Word, um, and this is an amazing part of His truth. And he speaks in so many different ways. I mean, I know a lot of you have seen numbers. I've seen numbers. Um, there, I've had birds, lots of birds. I've had hummingbirds, you know, fly right in my face and walk with and fly with me as I'm walk, on my walks with Jesus. Sorry about my moving around. I'm not good with all technical. I know some of you are really good with these shows and do these cool technical pictures. I'm not like that. <laughs> Mine's real simple. I just hold the camera up. <laughs> it's hard to look through the Bible sometimes when you're reading the Word, but it's the way God has me do it. Now, sometimes the Word is powerful, and, and it's like um, fire, and sometimes, you know, and, and we know that He's the refiner's, he has the refining fire. Jesus comes, and He's got fire in His eyes, a lot of people don't want to see that part of Jesus because they want to just stick with the grace part of Jesus. But grace is the Father who is in heaven. Grace is, you know, they're one. that they, they come different times depending on the state of the person. Um, we know that the state of the churches are sleeping, a lot of them. Not all of the people in the churches are sleeping. They're living in denom de denominations, which is... For me, it's called demon nations um, because religion is regarding the legion of demons. Jesus is God, plain and simple. Jesus Christ is God, plain and simple. Um, we have many people who have near-death experiences and die, and who do they come back saying, who is God? Who's on the, on the judgment seat? Christ. Who's with them in hell? Christ. Jesus. Who is on the throne of heaven? Yeah. This is all the great mystery. And God has revealed it to those people that he, is, he has sanctified by his word over time. For me, it's been over 40 years, 40 some odd years. Um, 40 plus years. I can't remember how many years over 40. But anyways, 
um, that I've been reading the Bible, but really what it is is he planted the seed in me and he watered me over time. It wasn't just, you know, one day I just all of a sudden got the whole word. Now, I've heard of people get that. That's a wonderful thing. But I've walked with God my whole life, and I've always always uh, kept the testimony of Jesus Christ and the gospel of Jesus Christ in my heart. That's where it needs to be, is in your heart. I've had many afflictions because I've sinned. I've continued to sin, and, um, and, and um, with that comes affliction. It's the fire of God. Um, correcting me, um, rebuking me sometimes, you know, if I'm listening to an, a spirit of error, you know, before he fully cleansed me and I can be more aware of the difference between the, the voices and I know the voice of God now. It takes time to discern those things and time to really um, listen to the, the voice of God and know the difference. And he's been clean, cleaning me up so much. I can't even tell you Jesus Christ is amazing. He's been sanctifying me and purifying me. And like I know he's done all my brothers and sisters on YouTube. He has been sanctifying and transforming and renewing the people that are on, on the YouTube channels. And what are they talking about? The Word of God. Yep, it's all about the Word of God. Because Jesus is the Word of God, become flesh. And he is moving, flowing from the Father's throne. He says, drink of my cup and your your." And you will be have eternal life. And it, it's, there's so much excitement. I've got so much to share with you guys. The spirit of truth has come into the world, and um, and I believe that's what's going on. One of the, one of the things that's going on. Um, these people that are that are coming with with Jesus Christ, eternal Father. Um, these people understand the word more than anyone else. They have Jesus Christ's spirit of prophecy, the spirit of truth. They also have revelation. Um, God is revealing to them the um, hidden manna in the word, the mysteries of, of the word of God. Why? Because of his presence. His presence is inside of us. He's with us. He's, he's speaking to us. He's quickening our bodies to speak the word of truth. Um, and so he's come to us into earth. Now, it's all about the kingdom of God. I've been telling people, repent, the kingdom of God has come. A lot of people are saying he's coming. Well, he's here in the spirit, guys. He's here in the spirit. When you tell someone, when you sanctify her, because we're um, the kingdom of priests and, and um, priests and kings, uh, ministers of God's word, and um, Jesus Christ is my high priest. He teaches me. He's my rabbi. I have no other teacher other than him. I go. I have. Pa I have. I know pastors. I know teachers who who say the word to me and correct me and 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 help me also throughout my whole life. Even a homeless man can speak through. God's can speak through. He can speak through nature to me. He can speak through any way he wants. He can speak through. Um, a movie. Um, I haven't watched TV in a, such a long time because I just would rather continue. Um, being filled with his spirit and word um, that those things just don't matter to me anymore you know unless he's moving me by the spirit to do something um, uh, we're not in our immortal bodies yet let me make that one thing clear um, and I am not perfect um, God, only God is good Jesus said only God is good but I believe that the people that are doing this the people that have this wisdom it's not our wisdom it's not our knowledge it's not the, our hidden, um, the hidden man is not ours. It's, it's his. He's sanctifying us. It's his work. It's his work on the cross that he, he did. Um, it's all about him and what he's done. Why? Because he's made promises to us. His promises, he keeps his promises. He, he doesn't lie. He doesn't do any of that. He is true blue. Oh, that's funny because this guy is blue and he talks about sapphire blue is like one of the foundation stones so, of New Jerusalem. So it's real exciting. And I had a blue light flash in my whole body um, one night whenever I was healed of like so many things that I could go on about that. That's very exciting. But um, in 2013, in March, the end of March 2013, Jesus Christ himself in, in, a, in an instant, in a twinkling of eye, took my 
my spirit out of my body and in an instant I was in like space type place on he was on a white horse next to me and we were sitting side by side looking out into space um, I was on a white horse too I have a video about this um, but and we were looking out at space and um, the, the greatest part about it is I felt peace love and joy and what is the fruit of this that that's the fruit of the spirit and I just felt total harmony with him and I just was in love with him he was on my left hand side and we were just looking out into space spending time together I believe it was giving me um, uh, an idea of what was what was coming and he had already started working in me since 2000 to really working in, in in me and showing me things in 2009 or 2007 but in 2011 he gave me the words God agape which means God's um, sacrificial love for um, mankind and our reciprocal love for him in obedience so um, I'm just speaking right now but I'm going to be giving scripture and everything to all of this and um, his word is good <laughs> His word is good. I'm going to end this right now because um, I believe that um, there's a time for um, for these videos that I should probably stay with. And I don't want to be um, going over my time or um, I don't I want to make things real simple and easy for you guys. Uh, but uh, what, am I, what am I saying? Okay, so these people, they do many things. They bring the word of God to people to correct, rebuke. Um, maybe it's just for for um, comfort, because uh, Holy Spirit Spirit is comforter. Um, sometimes it's for um, for moving people to Him. They need to go closer to Him, so we tell them to go seek pr seek Him in prayer, um, talk to Him in relationship, seek the truth from Him, ask Him questions, not not to get all their information from us. Although you know we're pretty good source of information but you should always check everything with God in Jesus Christ's name um, now some of us now we've all been refined with fire we've all been through the affliction the refinement process whether to see whether or not we are true and um, Oh, there's so much more, so much more. I'm going to end this, and then we'll go ahead and go on to the next part of the video um, uh, in the second part. And I'll give all the scripture and everything. All right, see you soon.